on our mortals, mortal to And today, I'm going to show you how to spawn in the tech armor with the short commands. So you, so it's really easy to spawn them in. And I'm going to show you the tech rifle as well, and also how to spawn the element in that you're going to need to power or the suit and the gun. Well, first, a small disclaimer. If you haven't unlocked the tech engrams, I'm going to show you here. If you haven't unlocked the tech engrams for whatever you want to use, it will not work. You need to unlock all, the, well, whatever you're going to use. So we're going to spawn in the tech armor plus the tech rifle. You need to have these engrams unlocked before you are able to use them. Because I get a lot of comments saying it's not working and the usually answer is that they haven't unlocked the tech engram. You have to unlock the tech engrams before you'll be able to use it. So, that out of the way, let's just get on to the short commands, what we're going to need. So, I'm going to start off with the helmet and I'm going to work my way down. And then we're going to spawn in the tech rifle and so on and so forth. So, I've already got the tech helmet up. Boom and done. So right here. So this is the code. So it's GFI Tech Helmet, which is one word, space one. Now I'm going to show you. You don't have to put that there. You can put a zero. Okay. So it's space one, space zero, space zero. Now the numbers, I'm going to go through what the numbers are. So this one indicates how many of the item that you want. This zero means what quality you want it at. And this one means if you, it's only two variants. is It's zero or one. So one stands for you want the blueprint. Zero stands for you actually want the item. So we can do this and we'll just get a normal tech helmet. So that is our normal tech helmet. Actually, I'm going to put. Uh, I'm going to drop that one. Uh, I think I dropped mine. Yeah, I think I dropped my painted one somewhere. But anyway. So yeah, this is the normal tech helm, uh, helmet with 100 armor and weight and whatever else. So, but, 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 but. With the tech armor, you can actually change the armor rating on it because the tech doesn't have any like um, tier system. Uh, like most of the stuff in Ark has, like you've got Ramshackle, Journeyman, Apprentice, uh, Mastercraft, and Ascendant stuff. They're the tiers that you can get. Tech doesn't have that, but. You can change this middle number here to represent how much of the stuff it's on. I'm going to put in 100 because 100 is usually the maximum you can get anyway. But you can put in 1,000. It doesn't really particularly matter. So I'll pull it in. I'm going to show you the difference between the normal tech helmet and then uh, the one I just spawned in. So as you can see here, this one's got 100 armor. Right? We go over... This has now got 1,260.1 armors, and the durability has gone up as well. Same as the hypo and the hyper uh, simulation has gone up. As you can see, it's 100 durability and 5 and 30, and the insulation ones. If we look on here, it's now gone to 30.5 and 122.3 on the insulations, and it's gone up to 4,622 on the durability so let's drop that crappy one we don't need that crappy one so that is the helmet but that literally is how easy it is to spawn in on so I'm gonna move on to the chest piece and really all we need is the one word so it's not unfortunately it's not called chest piece it's actually called I'll show you we'll get rid of this tech helmet part here and we'll put in this. Oh no, we'll put in this. It's called the tech shirt. Weird, yes, but that's why it's called the tech shirt. And we're just going to put this back down to zero. And we'll spawn one in. 
boom, we've got the tech chess piece now. Which armor is 180. I'm pretty sure that's just default. I made this out of the tech replicator and the armor is the same. But we want a better piece. So we'll go to this middle number and we'll change it to 100 again. And we'll do that. We'll just spawn another one in and we'll check what armor rating we got now. So now it is 1949.5 armor <laughs> and the durability has gone up a lot as well so let's drop that one so we've got two pieces but that is how easy it is so it's gfi tech shirt which is one word space one space whatever quality you want it at then space zero or one depending on if you want the blueprint or not i don't advise getting the blueprint um, because it's going to take a lot of resources just to make it from the blueprint. So I don't recommend it. I just recommend getting the item itself. So, what is next? We'll go with the gauntlets, shall we? So what do we need for the gauntlets? These are actually... These are not called tech gauntlets. These are called something else. So, get rid of that, and we'll put that in. That's what they're called. It's Tech Gloves. So, it's G-F-I, Tech Gloves, Space 1, or however many you want, Space, what quality you want it at, Space 0. That's what I recommend. So, let's put this in. I'm not going to go with the normal ones. I'm just going to go straight with the absolutely ridiculous armor ones. So, 2,533.7 armor. Absolutely amazing. So that's the gauntlets covered. Now we are going to move on to the leggings. So, and yet again, these aren't called what you think they're going to be called. They're not called tech leggings for the name of them. They're actually called, let me get it all. I'll show you. This is what they're called. Boom, tech pants. Yes, tech pants, not tech leggings, tech pants. So it's GFI tech pants, space one, space whatever quality you want, space zero. Let's put them in. And now we've got the tech leggings. And um, what are the armor rating on these? 990, uh, 899.9, still a really good armor rating. Now you can put this code in several times. I've just clicked it several times and you see we've just got four of them. Uh, but it'll give us like different armor variants. So the first one we got was 899.9. We don't want that one. But now as you can see, we've got different armor variants. It doesn't give you an, an exact armor. So if you put this code in like several times, it will give you different variants of the armor rating and durability. So they're no good, they're no good, they're no good. But now we've got 2,291 armor rating for the leggings. Ridiculous. So, last but not least, for the tech armor, we have the boots. Now, these are called tech boots. So, this is a pretty simple code. <laughs> so, boom, tech boots. Put it in. We've got tech boots. Needs has got 364.3 armor. Let's see if we can do better. I'm going to hit it a couple of times. Let's say four. One, two, three, four. I'll go back and just spawned in four of them. And we'll see. You see, now all these armors have gone up. So the original ones we got, 364. Nope. Now we got loads of these. These are the best with 2,453.9 armor ratings. So boom, boom. Uh, boom. You can keep the other ones spare if you really want to. Um, you can just put them away just in case you lose them. And you want to go and recover a bag, you can go, and you've got a spare set of armor. But anyway, so yeah, that is all the tech armor. I hope you, I hope that came up all right. I did change them. I didn't change the names. I did read out the names apart from this one. So it's GFI Space Tech Boots, which is one word. Space, however many you want. Space, the quality you want it at. And space if you want it a blueprint or not I recommend not getting the blueprint just get the item so that is all the tech armor now we want the tech rifle do we or do we not 
So this one is pretty straightforward yet again the the name is what it says it is which is really good. So it's just tech rifle. So it's GFI space tech rifle which is one word space how many you want of it space the quality you want to tap then space then if you want the blueprint or up blueprint or not but I put it as zero because I just want the item. But I'm going to say a big but now. I'm going to get rid of this because I want to show you that it doesn't matter what quality you want your tech rifle at. It will not give you a better rifle than the default. So this is the default rifle that we're going to get. Right there. Because this has 100% weapon damage and... It doesn't seem to change no matter what you do to it. So, if we go and change the code. I want, like, see, I want to try and get a better quality. I'm going to put 100 in. And then I'll spawn another one in. Take a rifle. And as you can see, there's literally no difference whatsoever. It's the same weapon damage, it's the same durability, it's the same weight. Now, I don't know why this is. I don't know why the weapon damage doesn't change on it, but it's been the same ever since they uh, initially released it. You cannot up the weapon damage on it like you can with the other, like, weapons and stuff. Because here, this one's, this is just a hatchet, but this is just an example. The weapon damage is usually default. I don't know what it is, but this one is on 208. And same with the long neck rifle, this is on 184.2. So I don't know why the weapon damage doesn't change on the tech rifle, which is unfortunate. Not even the durability changes, which is really unfortunate as well. Um, so yeah, you can do it all with the armor to get the armor rating up. But unfortunately with the tech rifle, you cannot increase this weapon damage. It's a bit sad. Well, there you go. So I'm just going to quit one down here. I'm going to get it out. Sure. So let's go and find... I want to try and find something, right? So we can shoot it. Because I don't know what they base the weapon damage off. It says 100%, but boom. We're doing 438. Well, we did do a headshot then. Uh, oh, God. Die, man. Level is just beyond me. 110. Holy crap. So, yeah, this doesn't have a, a clip size or nothing. It doesn't hold any bullets. It has a. It heats up, and then it has to cool down. Just the way it goes. So, what are we going to need to power all the tech armor and the tech rifle? Well, you're going to need element. And there is a short code for this as well. It's really, really simple. All you need is the word element. That is all you need to change the code with. So let's just go kaboom. We'll get rid of this. And just put in the word element. Now unfortunately, like I said, you don't get any quality with this. So this has to be zero. Oh, well, This is zero and you don't get a blueprint or nothing. So that's at zero as well. Well, you do get blueprints, but it's already in the uh, tech replicator. But you can change how many you can get. Now, there's no point of putting in a hundred. There's absolutely no point because element only stacks in ten. In stacks of ten, that's the amount you can get. So I'll go and put in four hundred just so I can show you what it's like. So boom, seventeen. What? Seventeen? I don't know why I got seventeen. Hmm. That's super strange. Let's do it again. Ten. There we go. See, even if you put in a hundred, I don't know why you gave me random seventeen. And so, even if I, even though I put in a hundred to get me a hundred element, it will not give me it because of the stack size of element is only ten. So you put in ten, and you can just bash it a couple of times, or how many times you want to, and you just, I've just got ninety element. So we're full up an element. We don't need any more. And the usage rate isn't too bad for the tech armor or the tech rifle, to be perfectly honest. But that is everything. That is the short commands for the 
tech armor and the tech rifle so i hope this helps you out mortals i really really do it it saves you a lot of time than putting in the really really long commands now oh, before i go i actually want to show you the absolutely long command that you'd have to put in otherwise so this is for the tech rifle right uh, let's get rid of this that is how long the <laughs> the actual code is just to get the tech rifle that's the original code that you have to use to spawn it in which is absolutely ridiculous but with these short commands all you have to put in now is the GFI before it and the name of the thing you want now the names aren't as always the same as the as they um, appear on the things itself. Uh, example like the tech, uh, what is it, pants? Now tech leggings. They're not called tech leggings in the code. They're called tech pants. That's just an example. So you need the actual name, proper name of the item that you want. Why the hell is this spawned in? Go away. Don't know why that spawned in. Weird. See, you need the actual name of what you actually want to spawn in, and that's the only part that you will need. But anyway, Moles, I hope this helps. I uh, hope you found it informative. And if you need anything else like this, please don't hesitate to drop me a comment down below. And i uh, just have some fun with it, really. Try and get ridiculous armor with ridiculous armor amounts. Um... But don't forget, if you haven't unlocked the tech engrams, all this stuff will not work. Even if you have element and the suit, or even the rifle, if you haven't unlocked the engrams, none of this will work for you. So be warned. So, that is it, mortals. I hope you enjoyed. And if you did, don't forget to show the like button, who is boss, by punching it in the face. And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to click that subscribe button. And, as always, mortals, don't forget to share it with your family and your friends and around the world. But that is it. I am Mortal T. And I am out.